Hello to my fellow designers. Today I'm going to teach you easy way on how to make grids, like the ones you can find in graph paper. As some of you may have already know, you can download a graph paper texture from stock images websites. However, you can still do it yourself if you want to do a custom type. Now let's get right into it, shall we? Okay, first click a new file type the title you want as well as the width and height. After that, create a square size. Here I put 100 pixel by 100 as an example. Then go to object and select path and look for split into grid. Then you will see the option for rows and columns. The total will be the size of the total size of the row. As you can see here, it has become 99 pixel. Just change that into the total size you want. Uh, so here in this case, I would change it to 100 pixel. Always remember to check the total size before anything goes wrong. Then click preview to check the result. Change the value into numbers you like. Here, I think I'm go just going to uh, start with 5 first. Okay, now we have our first grid, but it's not done yet. Let's go change it into thinner stroke. Now, we create a new square that is the same size and make it into a little bit thicker. Combine them together. Now turn off the fill section. And now we shall be able to see our basic 5x5 five 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 basic grid. Simply group them together. Press Command or Alt on Window and drag to copy it into, into the side of it. And then Command or Control D to copy and paste the action. After you feel like you have a nice number of them in a row, copy paste a few more rows. Now select all and group it together. Okay, now we have basically made our first grid. Now let's move on with some extra steps. Select our grid and click expand. Then go to Pathfinder and unite them all. This is basically an extra step or it can be your final step. If you can confirm this is the graph you want because sometimes it will look as if the lines overlapping when you did not combine the lines okay now let's move that to the side and let's make another type of grid which is 10 by 10 again let's make another same size 100 by 100 pixels go to object and select path split into grid and make it 10 for rows and 10 for columns thickness of stroke let's make it into 0 0.5 and then make another square of the same size make it thicker thicker stroke maybe by one point
and split into two by two. Okay, make another square again. Change the thickness to around 1.5 point. And then group them individually. Then we group them together. Okay. Maybe we make the smaller square into 0 0.3 point. That looks pretty good to me. Now copy them like earlier. Command or Alt to drag and Command or Control D to copy paste earlier action. Okay, now we basically made two different types of grids on our own. Apply any color that you like and there you go. I will attach this file for you to download. Hope you enjoy this tutorial. Like if you love it. Sub if you want to follow for more contents. And that's it for now. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.